You're listening to Misunderstanding Dementia Podcast. This episode is brought to you by Misunderstanding Dementia Course, and you can put in 50-50 to get a 50% discount on the course. Thank you. Hello, everyone. This is Dr. Mike Chua, physical therapist, certified dementia practitioner, and the author of Misunderstanding Dementia and a lot more. Well, anyway, I just wanted to... uh, share to you today that uh, have you ever felt that sometimes as a caregiver you just want to shout you just want to you know give up and and just shout and just get out of that situation you know because uh, I just remember several weeks ago I went to a nursing home and uh, that patient didn't want she she just didn't want me you know she was just so mad and irritated and and I asked the the nurses hey what's wrong with the patient why why is that she's so mad at me and apparently, uh, the the patient's husband was killed by a Vietnamese. So she thought I was a Vietnamese that you know that killed her husband during those you know uh, crazy war times. And she was just upset. She doesn't she didn't want to see me. So there are times that you just want to let go and, and learn how to let go and, and not deal with it. So I just decided I just have to let go and, and not treat this patient. And uh, there's one thing or one tip that uh, you can really do to prevent you from getting mad. Basically, it's very simple. One tip that I am going to give you is basically do some breathing exercises. Your lungs, you know, when you're doing some breathing exercises, you're basically putting in good oxygen and removing that dirty carbon dioxide. So your lungs are just basically like a, a, a water cup. You know, so uh, let me turn this off. You know, your, your lungs are just like basically a water cup. You know, you cannot put in good clean water if you don't dump that dirty water out. Same thing with your lungs. You cannot put in good clean oxygen if you don't remove the dirty carbon dioxide. So just do some deep breathing exercises. If you feel like you just want to get out, you just want to shout, do some simple breathing exercise. It doesn't have to be a complicated uh, uh, thing. You know, just inhale to your nose and exhale to your mouth do it five times you know and that way you can be relaxed in you know in doing and trying to deal with your uh, uh, dementia patient or your loved one so that's my one tip for you today do breathing exercises and it will it will really help you you know I mean aside from counting one to ten obviously but I would really recommend do those breathing exercises inhale to your nose exhale to your mouth very simple do five reps of it and it will help you move on forward to the issues you're having in life so hey Ali, how are you um, i'm doing good i'm doing good thank you very much for watching and again that's our tip for you today just one tip and i will move you forward in taking care of your loved ones again god bless you and i'll see you around happy weekend and happy father's day to all dads out there bye-bye you're listening to misunderstanding dementia podcast This episode is brought to you by Misunderstanding Dementia Course, and you can put in 50-50 to get a 50% discount on the course. Thank you.